Vice President, good morning. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, as all of you know, I am about to leave for North Dakota, where the people are quite literally in the fight of their lives. What they have endured is enormous. How they are enduring it is remarkable. I am going to view the flood damage, to pledge our nation's support, to see that we are doing everything we can do to help them. You know, Americans have a habit of joining together at times like this, and I think all Americans have been very deeply moved by the pictures we have seen of a town being flooded and burning at the same time, the people uh, in North Dakota losing everything they have. I personally can't remember a time when a community that large was entirely evacuated. And we have to stay together. It may take a Marshall Plan to help North Dakota. Well, it may. I, you know, we've had, I suppose, we, because North Dakota is not highly populated, we may, we've had uh, disasters which have affected more people. But I believe that probably this is the highest percentage of people in any state or community I've, uh, that I have seen affected by this. And, and you know, if you look at, at Grand Forks, you, you, you see a place that literally has to be completely rebuilt or people have to reconstitute their lives elsewhere. So I do believe that, uh, that we're going to have to be prepared uh, to, to be very creative here. Uh, the Congress has shown in the past, even when it was quite uh, costly, uh, after the earthquake in California, for example, that, uh, that we can unite across party lines to do what has to be done. We need to take a hard look at this. This situation in North Dakota is virtually unprecedented in many, many ways. And I want to go out there and make sure that I have read all the information available, talk to the people there, see for myself, and then uh, we'll, I'll come back and along with the congressional delegation with Senator uh, Dorgan and Senator Conrad and Congressman Pomeroy, we'll put our heads together and see where we go from here.